What's up guys, my name is Nax, and I hope everyone is having a great day so far. Um, before we start, make sure to leave a thumbs up on the video and subscribe for more. Um, that really helps me out and supports me and encourages me to do more tutorials. But anyways, um, what you want to do first is go over to the internet. Go ahead and type in Photojet. That is the website we're going to be using. I'm going to click the first one. Um, you should come up to this page right here. Scroll down to YouTube banner, although we are creating a thumbnail, not a banner. I'm going to scroll, oh, go right here, press get started. <clears throat> While this is loading, I'm going to go and open a new tab and going to find your background for your thumbnail. If you want a solid color, a pattern, uh, actual picture of something um, whatever you want just go ahead and search that up it's going to be 1280 by 720 that is the file hold on that is the thumbnail size for a YouTube thumbnail um, you can crop it and do all that but I just like to use presets that are already that size and I don't know what is going on I don't know why it says one, two, three movies right here. Okay, thank you. Once you search that up, um, go ahead and click images. Dude, oh my gosh. I'm sorry. 1280. One, two, eight, zero. Okay, can I click this, please? Solid. solid color okay go to images and let's find one this one looks nice I'll just do this one this one nope that's not the right size okay this one is 1280 by 720 as you can see it right there go ahead and save this to your computer then I'm gonna go back to photojet okay so it should be like this go ahead and add a photo on the right hand side computer and you're going to want to find the photo that you just got. And this is the size of it right here. Um, oh my gosh. Okay. Um, go ahead and get a picture that you want. Of course, it needs to be transparent because if it isn't, then it'll have a big, ugly, white circle, or not circle, square in the background. That does not look good. I'm going to save this, blah, blah, blah. I already have that saved. As you can see, I'm going to add photo, computer, again, um, go down here, uh, as you can see, there it is, open that, regularly click it, um, that should be good right there, okay, so once you added that I'm just gonna go ahead and resize it again uh, put that over here okay so if you want to add text of course go over here um, these are all the preset ones with like glows and outlines um, of course you can add your own uh, font if you want or you can use theirs Ooh, that doesn't look good. Okay, so you're gonna have your title somewhere, wherever you want it to be, of course. Um, this is whatever you want. And uh, let's go ahead and add another picture. Go ahead and 
equip that. Bring that down here. Get that a bit bigger. Um, okay, and I think that's gonna be it. Once you are done with it and you are ready to save, go and press save up here at the top. Um, uh, sample. Sample. Um, hi. Uh, I'm gonna do it as a PNG, not a JPEG. Rendering, 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 rendering. Uh, save to your computer. Okay. And go to your files. Let me open this up. Um, let's see. Where is it? At? What did I name it? Oh, I named it sample. Then, geez, look at all these. You can see how many times I've messed up with this thing. Where's it at? Oh, it's right here. Oh my gosh, not fresh paint. Um, open with photo gallery, and I'm just gonna show y'all, so y'all believe me. Oh, there it is. Like and subscribe. Um, as it says, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe for more. And I guess uh, see you in the next one.